So Donald Trump calls into Janine Pirro's Fox show and uh, they had a little bit of an issue in the very beginning of this interview. Take a look. Mr. President, thanks for getting back to us. Janine. Hi. Okay, so let's get how, right to how it. Is, how is your reception now, Janine? They had yeah, a security reception situation, but never, right, never sounds on. too good. Is it okay? It's okay, and you're you're on air right now, Mr. President. So good, let's I like get that. to it. Good with you, okay. I like being on air. Hi. <laughs> that was amazing. But you know what? I'm sure that that short interaction really resonated with Fox News's audience, considering the dominant demographic that watches. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> a lot of people going like, "Oh, I could sympathize with that." <laughs> I mean, when I'm on the phone, I don't know what's going on. Who's speaking? What's going on? Uh, look, it's a little bit of a miscommunication. It's not the end of the world. Uh, but it was just funny. It's just a little bit of fun. Uh, but uh, as usual with Trump, uh, even when he's being despicable, he's a tiny bit entertaining. That's what the right wing really likes about him. So uh, the part I was actually more amused by is when he said later in the interview, uh, "In Janine, you have beautiful ratings. Beautiful ratings, okay? Everything goes everything boils down to ratings, television, is it good, is it not good, is the marketing good? He thinks of everything in terms of a reality show. Yeah. And it's devastating because people voted him into office thinking, oh yeah, yeah, he's a smart, savvy businessman. He's gonna run the country like a business, which by the way, running the country like a business is a bad idea to begin with. But no, 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 he's not a smart, savvy businessman. He's not running the country like a business. If anything, he's running the country as if it's a giant reality show and it's a disaster. Well, he's running the country like it's a circus. Yeah. Uh, and if you're a clown, that makes sense. That's all you've ever worked in before. And that's and so Janine Pirro uh, is a maniac. Have you ever watched her show? <laughs> She comes on air and look, you won't get animated from time to time, I do, right? But her, she's screaming at the top of her lungs from minute one. And that's just the way she talks. She's like, and now on Janine Pirro show. And you're like, well, geez, of Lord mercy, what happened, right? And so Trump, we look at this and you go, oh, that's a clown, right? Yeah. And Trump looks at him and goes, hey, that's a clown. That's one of my people. She has beautiful ratings. So anyone who kisses ass, which she does on a regular basis. She almost lives up there. Uh, Trump absolutely go. That's it. That's it. This is like when Kim Jong Un wrote me a beautiful letter, and I fell in love with him. He literally said when he fell in love that they fell in love together. Him and Kim Jong Un. Ugh. It doesn't matter if you're a murderous dictator or Bozo the Clown on Fox News. There's only one thing he needs for you to kiss his ass. And the minute you do that, good job, Janine. Good job. I'm going to call in on a secure connection here, okay? <laughs> Janine Pirro strikes me as the type of person who probably stockpiled Fen Fen when she found out that it was likely going to be banned by the federal government. She's like, no, no, no I need the Fen Fen. I need the Fen Fen. I feel like she's on Fen Fen on every single episode. She is on one. I, I don't even know what Fen Fen is. <laughs> it was that diet pill that had, you know, people had like heart conditions after taking it. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well that then <laughs> then it's an interesting theory. We don't know for sure, okay? It, it is speculation <laughs> on my part. You know what? And to be fair to judge uh, judge Janine Pirro, God imagine if you were in her courtroom. <laughs> like you're like, "All right, I'm going to get some justice here." She's, "Well, let me tell you what's happening." You're like, "Jesus <laughs> Christ, that's my judge. That's the judge. I'm more stable than she is, and I'm on trial." Okay, anyway, <laughs> to be fair to judge Janine Pirro, she might have natural fen fen built in. Thanks for watching this free clip of the Young Turks. Don't forget to become a TYT member today. For more exclusive content, join now at tyt.com/join.